There is only one boss, the customer. And he can fire everybody in the company from the chairman on down, simply by spending his money somewhere else. The art of effective listening is essential to clear communication, and clear communication is necessary to management success. No serious-minded man should have time for the mediocre in any phase of his living. Do not primarily train men to work. Train them to serve willingly and intelligently. The five separate fingers are five independent units. Close them in the fist multiplies strength. This is organization. Responsibilities are given to him on whom trust rests. Responsibility is always a sign of trust. My definition of an executive's job is brief and to the point. It is simply this, getting things done through other people. It is the service we are not obliged to give that people value most. I had to pick myself up and get on with it, do it all over again, only even better this time. I am grateful for all of my problems. After each one was overcome, I became stronger and more able to meet those that were still to come. I grew in all my difficulties. How can we expect our children to know and experience the joy of giving unless we teach them that the greater pleasure in life lies in the art of giving rather than receiving? Intelligence is the effort to do the best you can at your particular job, the quality that gives dignity to the job, whether it happens to be scrubbing a floor or running a corporation. In every man's life there lies latent energy. There is, however, a spark that, if kindled, will set the whole being afire, and he will become a human dynamo, capable of accomplishing almost anything to which he aspires. They serve best who give most of themselves. Self is forgotten by the one who serves, for such a one rejoices to see success coming to others through his or her efforts. A merchant who approaches business with the idea of serving the public well has nothing to fear from the competition. The men who have furnished me with my greatest inspiration have not been men of wealth, but men of deeds. The well-satisfied customer will bring the repeat sale that counts. The keystone of successful business is cooperation. Friction retards progress. I learned that all things come to those who wait provided they hustle while they wait.